Here is Rowan Dennis. Giving that a little bit of air on the front wheel over the top of that climb, really trying to keep the pressure on. At the intermediate split point, he wasn't really in the ballpark, but Rowan Dennis tends to ride negative splits. A little bit of air then on these speed ramps. There are quite a few speed ramps to encounter. You've really got to take them fast, but you've got to jump them a little. As Rowan Dennis makes his way now into these last few turns. Just a little bit like the bike's moving around. 21.10, he's got a minute and 20 seconds to get to the finish line. And he's not under the red kite yet, I don't think. There is the red kite. So this is doable by Rowan Dennis, but he really needs to keep the pressure on. It's all downhill to the next roundabout, chasing 22.32. Remy Cavagna, if he stays in the hot seat and Rowan Dennis beats him, then Cavagna will put a real smile on his face and may well be thinking, right, this time trial is mine. Dennis throwing it round this next turn. Well, he's not there in the hot seat, Remy Cavagna. He's obviously disappeared or he's lying down. Left-hand turn, Rowan Dennis, and a swoosh to the right. 500 metres to go. This is going to be really touch and go for Rowan Dennis. Can he beat the time of Remy Cavagna? He's got one roundabout and a sprint to go, and he's got 22 seconds to get there. Dennis now with a big acceleration, a huge turnout of that roundabout. Dennis has got 14 seconds to reach the line. Can he do it? Remy Cavagna's time, 22.32. And Rowan Dennis smashes it, five seconds. Rowan Dennis, top of the leaderboard. What a ride by the world champion of a couple of years ago. Rowan Dennis through those corners the bike was drifting a little bit on that final corner up at the top of the hill but look at the amount of power he's putting in he was disappointed in the Paris time trial but today Rowan Dennis looks like he's well back up there we're just waiting for confirmation of the time uh, how do you feel after today's victory in the ATT of La Volta uh, relieved uh, it's been a long time between drinks if I'm if I'm completely honest with you, and it's been a it's been a tough little road, uh, but it's it's really great to be back on top of that uh, that top step, and it's it's just it's amazing the team they've they've always supported and believed in the fact that I can be back on that step that top step, and I oh yeah, it's, it's just amazing to be back here.